everyone welcome back to another undead world hero survival episode today we'll be featuring the top heroes in zombie express this is actually based on the ranking that i actually extracted from the game itself so just to give you a you know a kind of information on how i came up with the top heroes i actually take a look uh, took a look at the rankings and uh, as you can see here it's one two this is actually a long ranking um i only extracted up to 30. so what i'm saying is this is the top 30 teams and these are the teams sorry, these are the heroes that they're actually bringing in terms of the top teams i couldn't see any significant team that is actually contributing uh with the top tier teams but again these are the top heroes that you'll be seeing from this video and also why are we you know why are we uh, ranking high in this in zombie express because of this one the material uh this is your i think this is your energy drink so we need this in terms of leveling up our our heroes there is a certain level um, in your in in leveling up where in sometimes you get stuck. So this is the material that you need. So that is why we need to farm this and we need to rank um, for that so that we could get a lot of this uh, energy drinks. So just to you know just to show you guys uh, what it looks like in terms of the battle summary report. So this is actually what I see. In terms of the equipment, it usually just um, reflects the level of uh, what they call this, the level of the heroes. So what I meant to say was, if you see a certain type of hero, it doesn't mean that if you bring that hero, um, that's the only win condition. The other win condition would also be the hero level. But here are at least a, a number of heroes that you should level up from the start so that you won't you know you won't waste resources in transferring um your levels to another hero so more or less to start i'll show you guys from the top 30 teams i don't know if you can see it but as <laughs> as the top two dictates it's going to be murray and Brittany. murray is 22 usages out of 30 so that's a high percentage Next is going to be Brittany at 22 out of the 30. Next is Lita. 18 out of the 30 teams are using her. And also you have here Rock, 16. And to round out your top 5, you have Connor, 10 out of, um, out of 30. So as you can see here, most of the top 4... I'm oh, sorry. Most of the top four are AOE damage dealers, except for Murray. Okay, but Murray's skills are very unique that he's good with single target and with uh, a bunch of, you know, bunch of zombies in front of him. So again, um, these, these four are a must for you to level up or to play in this game, especially for this content uh lita here is the only i think um support that i see but uh we have uh, range aoe aoe and support and for connor i think he is one of again the top uh tanks for this stage so connor has 10 then for the next five we have here tyler abigail uh, meredith sam and gabriel so for the next five it's going to be your tanks mixed in with support, which is Meredith and Sam, which is AOE. So Sam actually shines here. So for the top 30, again, Sam is going to be in your top 10. So you can't, you can't really, you know, go wrong with the lineup with one tank and the rest would be AOE that is, or AOE or range and probably one support so that is why you have here uh, meredith you also have lita so basically they're the top supports for your zombie express go down further the line you have helen lee caddy tanya nadim and um the others are just singles which is mary astra henry kieran and axel so try to this list is just um 
is just um, for you guys to be able to check whether you should focus that hero um, in using him or her in Zombie Express. So at least now you know um, the formation. The, the usual formation that I see is going to be three AOE slash range. Um, one is going to be your support. Commonly used is going to be uh, Lita, of course. And you have to have one tank. So do not bother to put two tanks in this stage because you need a lot of AOE damage here. So again, and also... Uh, just you know just want to revert back to what i said earlier not only the heroes are you know dependent on your success in zombie express but also their level because as you level them up up to legendary you'll be unlocking their um their, their exclusive weapons so again it's crucial that you stick to a core and you level up them for their exclusive weapons i will be showing you guys another list here so this one on your right is going to be the top formations used in Zombie Express. So as you can see here, uh, one is suppressing, uh, wrong spelling, suppressing fire at 11 and balanced at 8. So that they roughly, you know, take up around 66% um, of the formations. So and the third one is zigzag. Fourth is spearhead. Seven a uh, seven five is Z formation, and the rest is one protects all and tactical. So let's let's take a look on why it it's interesting that you use uh, suppressing fire and balanced here. So let's go back to your formation. So here it is. Balanced is the first formation that we usually use. We have been using this um so far um as i can remember when we start so as you can see here one which is your usually tank is placed here then you will have here at the back your damage dealers and um, usually for your supports your supports are usually placed here because um that one gives more hp and at the back uh, it's going to be attack and evasion Okay, so that is why supports are sh uh, should be in the middle, but you can actually consider them in, in the back as well. But preferably for me, I would put them in the middle. So the rest are range or AOE. Then the next is going to be suppressing fire. As you can see, uh, there is a... This is built really for offense. Three at the back will really give you a lot of um, buffs in terms of uh, attack power and um, evasion um, very good position to put your range or aoe at the back then number two is going to be your support if you have one support you can put them at number two for suppre suppressing fire then your tank would be at number one so again these lineups are just a suggestion because they perform well in zombie express um probably after a month i'll redo this the, this report because again um this might change in a couple of weeks or months now that we know that who to focus on um what is the ideal formation who are the ideal heroes but again in terms of a specific team there's really really none standing out um out of the 30 there was i think only one duplicate so the rest of the lineups are very unique. So nothing stand out. As we progress, you know, further in the game, as we have more heroes in the future, I think this will change. But for now, Murray, Brittany, Lita, Rock, and Connor as your um, tank can actually be your top five already. So <laughs> you can actually use this team um, for Zombie Express. This is actually a very good <laughs> team already. Um, Lita is actually a very good support here. So that is it, guys. So what I will do for um, this two left inside reports, I'll put them in the comment section. I hope this report or this evaluation of Zombie Express Top Heroes helps you in your progress and ranking up. And uh, the only variable here that you know that changes is actually the level of the hero, but. The heroes in itself can already, you know, help you climb up the rankings for zombies. Okay, guys. So thank you very much for staying this far in this video. And 
please do consider subscribing if you haven't subscribed yet um also don't forget to click that bell icon so you don't miss any videos from this channel and guys uh please put a like to this video if you find this informative thank you guys take care stay safe this is the warden and i'm out of here